Okay, apparently nobody has any other ideas because no one wrote anything. <laughs> so that's what I'm thinking. Is everyone there? Okay, good. So I told you what I'm doing. Guess we'll see if this swishes. It's very spready right now. But I'm not doing it unless it swishes. It's worth watching. It was thinning out. It's not really thinning out now. All right. So then I guess we're going to find out. There it was spreading a hair of 45 it just broke no it didn't break it looks like it was gonna wow there is a 40 some cent spread now okay let's just keep watching it I thought it was gonna break 45 it didn't but that is a two dollar bar but the one spread there was really big it's moving a lot I'm not being aggressive in anything today This spread is crazy. It was 50 cents just at one point. Oh, that's... All right, so I'm just watching this. First bar was big. Second bar is just sitting here. Spread is really varying a lot with this. I haven't called any entries in this at all. I'm not sure that this holds. It may flip. Let's see. Even if we do this today, this is going to be a wide stop. I can tell that right now. All right, so the Qs are trying to turn around. SPY is moving higher. What happened to ADP? Still low volume. Hmm. Okay, I haven't called any entries in this whatsoever yet. But it's rolling over once. It didn't swoosh, but it did have a big first move. It looks like it winded. No. Lulu looks great. Called the option in Lulu Friday. Did anybody do it? Galahad, did you do it? Lulu looks very good. Okay, still watching once. Haven't called any entries in it. Wanted to do it if it swooshed. It's going now to 44. 
Did anybody short it? If you did, it was a huge stop, and I didn't call the entry, but it's it's trying to roll over. Actually, this is swishing now. It just broke 44. All right, so maybe we're going to do it if something makes sense. Did anyone do it on your own? 43.90 was a low in there. I've called no trades in this, and it's very spready, and we need something to make sense, but it, it's it's broken. So I'm going to watch it for a setup, as long as the stop makes sense. But I'm not doing a dollar and a half stop in this. And I'm, I, you know, with the spread changing the way it is, it's it's five minutes into the open, it doesn't seem to be getting tighter. I'm still watching once. We might do it. I'm just wondering if anybody did it on your own. I've called no entries in it. I wasn't crazy about it. I wanted it to break. It did. So. It's unbelievably spready. Green Maverick hasn't done anything? Okay. All right, let's look at it. I think we're going to be able to do a trade in this if we get an entry right. So let's just look at this here, here, here. Da, 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 da. Well, this has gone more than a buck from here, but the stop would have been $1.50. So we can do this if it sets up. It's going to go right down to 43 Wow, look at that. In fact, it just did. All right, my, my oh, just broke 43. We might get lucky today, people. I'm watching this to do. In fact, let's look at the targets now. But I, I was not aggressive. And if anybody was, they don't want to cop to it. So target today in this is going to be 40. And I do believe the stop is probably going to be a buck. Wow, this is going to go down to 42. Well, it is, look. Oh my gosh. This just moved five dollars plus and the, this did swoosh so i'm gonna i'm watching it for the entry but i think the stop's gonna be big this is what i wanted it to do though galahad did the lulu option anybody else this isn't done just let it keep falling we're gonna we're gonna do that if we can get an entry in it now but i did not aggressively call it and i still think that was the right thing to do um spy is trying to hold cues are rally now Lulu is trying to run up to 75. And I'm watching this. It's swooshed. And here we are. We're waiting. Gypsy's in Lulu too. I'm a little bit surprised that no one shorted this out of the gate. I mean, I did not call it. But I'm surprised that nobody did it. Unless somebody did it and doesn't want to tell me. <clears throat> okay, forty one ninety, forty one ninety three. This is going to have a 40 50 cent cushion in it. It's going to be a big stop. So just let you know in your mind if you got to size yourself. And if we don't get it, we don't get it. But I hope that we do. It's just taking off. Oh, let's look at this thing. No, nope, 
this looks like a complete failure. It's pushing back today. Okay, watching once. I'm gonna be strict here. So that's probably gonna be a dollar and a half, but. See if this holds 45. So I would figure a dollar and a half, which is way more than I ever thought this would be, but. Okay, I'm gonna be strict here with what I know. If it rolls over here, then I'm not getting it because I'm not calling this here. I'm really gonna follow the rules. So I'm just letting you know today. I'm, I mean, this whole week, I'm following the rules. So I just did not do that in there and I didn't call it. And if it just rolls right on over, which it might, it might, then I won't get it. like it's rolling over I, I, I'm not in it so as you know for those of you that have already done the class some of you haven't yet I'm following the rules so I did not do that there and I didn't even make a call I'm not off of it yet but if it breaks the low it's probably just gonna go Okay, we might get this. We might get this yet. Following the rules is never a bad idea. All right. Mm This is just going to be a really big stop. So I think we're going to get this, but it's going to be just a huge stop. 
So I'm going to scalp it. So stop's going to be 44.50. This is going to be bigger than I thought even. It's going to be 25 by 50. Gosh, 25 by 50. 25 by 50. If it hits and we get a better number, I'll give it to you. 25 by 50 once. And I wouldn't jump the gun in case we better get a better entry. We've been patient enough so as it is. Okay, 50 by 50 we can do. 50 by 50 we can do. And that might be different. 50 by 50 we can do. This is a huge stop. And no one should be in this yet. It's nowhere near triggered. Nope, that's off. I'm going to give you different numbers. It hasn't triggered. It's a huge stop. We've been patient and patient and patient, and we're going to get it right. So all those numbers are going to be different. And this is just going to be a huge stop. Ugh. 45 is going to be the stop. 25 by 45 and you really got to watch what you're doing here with this 25 by 45 and i really wouldn't worry about this you're going to get filled where you get filled so don't jump the gun on it nobody's going to get a great price in this here Let it hit 25 by 45. And if you don't know what I mean, then don't do it. Because I don't have time to talk it out. And it might change again. Here, you can do it if you want to do it. Get in and if you want to do it and put this stop at 45. 45. You can take it right here. It's going to hit. Yeah, there it goes. And then let me just see if we're going to give it any more room of a cushion than that. No, I really don't want to. Put the stop at 45. Put the stop at 45. Be in it if you want to be in it. It hit. It hit. 43.25 was the entry. And if you did not know what I was talking about, then you, it was impossible for you to size yourself. This was not easy at all, and you need to be watching the stock trade at the same time as I do. I'm sorry, I just am reading your writings now. 43.25 was the exact entry, and as you know, I don't give the dollar sign, but this was not easy today, but it was a massive stop. So I told you figure a dollar, dollar fifty, ended up being, here, 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 hold on, we're scalping this. I'll answer all your questions later. Let's just not miss our exit on this today. 41.90 is a low. Let me just look at the market quick. If you are not in it, it is way too late. And it, this was not easy to do. And I don't even, the only reason we're even doing it is because of the fact that it did swoosh, which we will go over when we're done. And I was very patient and I think that was the right thing to do. And we're gonna scalp it. It's gonna, it's gonna break down again though. All right, is anyone in it with me? Call bear, if you didn't know the numbers then you're just, it's too late here now. Here, here it goes. Once. Do not miss your exit on this trade. I'm telling you right now. This was spready. It just was a way big stop. It's money. It's better than nothing. I wasn't even going to do anything today at all unless it swooshed, which it did. 
I was not aggressive on this. That absolutely was the right thing to do. Do not get out of this with no money. Get out of this with profit today. I don't care what it is. And that includes you, Galahad. If it's 50 bucks, get that out of it. Here, once. Let's see if it breaks through the low. Even though $40 is a target, this was not easy to do today. And this isn't an earnings gap, but it's not earnings season. We're doing what we can. All right, what we have to do is break through a five-minute chart. 42.25, we got to get through that five-minute, which I think that we do. Don't worry about ours today. Worry about making money. And that's the topic of discussion as soon as we're out of this. I, I, this is incredibly spready. I don't, I don't know. I don't even know. Have we ever traded this? I'm sure that we have, but in my mind, I was not even thinking <laughs> this kind of spread, but it just wasn't tightening up. And I will be doing no ads on this either today. But under 42.50 is the five minute, two minute, everything. Let's look at the chart. This bar screws this up in here, unfortunately, but I'll have to live with it. Forty-one twenty-seven. So forty-one twenty-seven, forty-one thirty, forty-one. Those are all numbers to watch. And actually, if you didn't do this, you could hit it here. It's backing up slightly where it where I called it. If you did not do it. This was not easy to do today because the numbers of the difference between the entry and the stop was different dollar sign number, which we which we get usually with expensive stocks, but not in this price point. So that was unusual. Stop was just really, really big. But if you really don't know, then you can't do the trade because you got to size yourself right, and that is important. It, the stop was 45, and the entry was not 44.25, but 43.25. A, it's spreading, and B, the bars are big. So here is where we have the stop. And the stock should not go over this number. If it does, it's not going to work. So I followed the rules today. Let's just review it. Stock broke in here. Really didn't set up right. But I saw this bar. I mean, you know, I was like, okay, maybe this is swishing. But, it, you know, watching the trade, it was too large. I'm like, okay, definitely it is. So it did broke down, fell, pushed back, held. Again, followed the rules. Very strict. You wouldn't have saved any money or did anything or missed out on anything doing it here versus here or anything else. If you had done this here, it would have been aggressive, and I just really didn't feel it necessary to be aggressive with this gap today. It's not that the gap wasn't good, but it wasn't amazing. But it clearly proved then it was weak after this moved down. Otherwise, we wouldn't be in it. And I said this really has to be perfect to do it which is very interesting. Looking back at some of the gaps that have worked extremely well in the last two weeks, I'd say, and the ones that have not, if you go back and look, again, the first five minutes of the day of how they've traded, you can learn a lot. And it just wasn't there now, looking back even at the ABOC from that morning. In fact, let's look at this here now. I mean, this is your, your stop isn't in this. If you're in it, you're in it. And I don't think we're going to have to be in this all day, but it didn't break the low yet. Actually, I want to have that up here. Let's look at this over here. This is AOBC from Friday. Here, let me, this is a two minute. Let me make it the one minute. This 
in here, looking back, again, I missed my exit, but I think it's just the price point of the stock that set me off thinking that it was going to have a bigger move. Then, and it did have a big move. Unfortunately, the move was in the flip. But anyways, I, I looked back and looked back. I said, should I have gotten out of that? Should I get out of that? I mean, I just don't see how I should have gotten out of that. You know, it wasn't that I was expecting more, but should have seen bigger drop in this to follow through in the morning faster. And the route, the pushback here was just very aggressive. So see the difference between this? Here, let me just tighten this up so you can see what I'm trying to say here. If this makes any sense. If you look at that, and you look at that, see so that looks very different. And if you didn't get the trade I called, you could have taken it in the back up here. See, we're going to break the low here. Hold on, let's pay attention because we're definitely not missing a right on this today. Does everybody see what I was just showing you there on that one compared to today's? Here, once. The only bad thing about this was that it is spready. And, it, and, and actually, the stop was big. The stop would have been big even if it wasn't spready, but that made it worse. Here, once. Galahad's watching the trade like a hawk. Here we go. Under 42, we should break through the low. Nice way to start the week. And I was not aggressive. But that doesn't mean I'm not going to be aggressive at all this week. I will be if we have a good gap. Here, once. Da, 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 da. And if this bounces, I'm just taking it out. 41.90 is a low. Watch it. I think it breaks it, but watch it. Here. Yay! Crap, come on, come on, come on, come on, go! Hand of the button for everybody! Come on, come on, come on, come on, go. Keep going, keep going. Oh, come on. 67, 69. Oh, I didn't get out of it. That bounced back just fast, too. I should have just taken it out. I think it's going to keep going, though. Here, hold on. I thought it was going to break 70. Here, 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 here. Here, 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 here. If you're out of it, you're out of it. If you're not, seriously, have your hand on the button. Here we go. Here, do, 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 do. Here, I'm out, I'm out, I'm out, I'm out, I'm out. I still think it goes to 41, 40, whatever. At least I got out with the 41 in front of it. Here, 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 here. This is just like the other one. God, can you seriously? Seriously. Oh, man. If you're in it, though, I still think it looks great to 41. Congratulations. We did a good job. That was good. And it was money, and it was fast, and we like that, and it's not even 10 o'clock. And we weren't going to do anything today. So that was very, very good. All right, let's quick look at the market, then we'll go over it. And here's the market, which is clearly along in the spy, but the cues don't look as great. And my only explanation is what? Nothing. So we'll have to wait and see. But these things have to get back around. The spy is nearing the highs. The cues are not. Let's look at the banks. And then we'll go over the trade. If you're still in it, you think it's going to 40. Gyro's half out. Oh, now he's completely out. Is anyone still in it? Koala Bear, you did it, but I thought you didn't know the trade. WFC, no. Why are this? The only thing I can think of is the banks, why the market's so much stronger in the spy here. Let's just look. <sighs> da, da, da. CJ's out too? Good job. CJ, did you size yourself correctly? 